But do you have any remorse or any apology to make for the disgusting lie you made against me and millions of innocent people who voted Leave, where you said that because they voted Leave, they don't like the look of foreign people, they must be racist or xenophobe. I voted to leave the European Union. That was on the ballot paper. It was not because of the colour of somebody's skin or their ethnicity or where they come from. It was to leave the European Union and you have so much distress and hurt to me. All right, it's a disgrace. Do you know, one of the people I most admire in politics was Tony Benn. And if he was alive today, he would have voted to come out of the EU. So I would never say that people voted to come out because they were racist. But there is no question that in the month, no, the month after the Brexit vote, we had a 41% rise in race hate. We saw me. that terrible killing of the Kurdish boy in Croydon. I'm not saying that there weren't good reasons to come out to vote to the EU, but let's be clear about the rise in hate crimes that yeah, we've seen I, since. Yeah, yeah. Diana, right. that would be very irresponsible, of, irresponsible right. of you to stir up this unfounded su suggestion that people who voted to leave the European Union are somehow racist, and that the killing, the awful so killing in Croydon, was motivated by Brexit. There is no proof so whatsoever of that, and I think it's irresponsible so and disrespectful. Listening to me, I would never say that people like Tony Benn were racist, but I, and it's not me saying there was a 41% rise in hate crime, it was the Metropolitan Police. Do yes, you think they're stirring up yeah. um, hatred? Yeah, but I think people are because what? No, because when we say hate crime, you've got websites, things like True Vision, you've got all of these mechanisms where people can press big red buttons and register a hate crime because people perceive that somebody's committed a hate crime against them. They're getting logged, they're getting registered, they're not getting validated. And I'm getting a little bit fed up with Brexit getting the blame for everything. Let and me, I want okay. to just...